Run, woman. Alright, so this is obviously going fantastic so far. Hello guys and welcome back to Bip King Gaming. I'm the Bip King and today we're going to be playing some more RimWorld. Now, um, in between filming this one or recording the, uh, this episode and the first episode, this has happened. We have some fire up here and um, this fire is very convenient next to two cougars, which is awesome. Um, so this might actually be as far as the Let's Play series goes. Uh, but we're going to grab these guys. We're going to send them up to here. Um, and then we are going to make this a home area. And hopefully when my guys come up here, we can start putting out this fire and that cougar won't come get us. Because that is what happened beforehand. That's going to happen which is gonna happen now. So, uh, we wanna get you here, you here, and here, and I'm not sure what she's doing. Run, run, woman. Alright, so this is obviously going fantastic so far. Alright, we got that. So you do that, and you focus on rescuing. Right. Hopefully, this other cougar will just kind of leave us alone. Um, people are just, there we are, at least we're getting this wall, uh, let's just do that, like that, and we'll clear all of this, because I'm not really fussed about that bit. It's just the wall, uh, because basically on the inside of this, there's a lot of um, ancient creatures that are going to come out and, yeah, basically just not be very nice to us. Uh, but it looks like we might survive. Uh, yeah, no, you, you're not a hauler. That's that's annoying. And at least we got some meat, so. Are they at least running back? Like, what are they doing? They just, like, don't seem to care. Okay, um... Right. Oh, he's running, he's running back up. Save the wall! Uh, yeah, so basically, like I was saying, before all of this chaos happened, um, in between the first episode and the second episode, I went to record, and then I came across this chaos which um was just all kinds of things came out of that room uh came down here and just killed me along with a big group of traders um but we should be all right for now hopefully no they're gonna have to keep running up there to to put out that fire but we should be all right we should be all right he says remo you are literally the only person Ooh. Pip King go. Let's do that. Prioritize. Prior prioritize fire. Oh, great. Someone's got an infection as well. So what we're going to do is we're going to change yours to a medical bed. And hopefully that'll work out. All right. God, this fire has really caused... It says we need batteries. Oh, it's because we haven't been able to build anything. Okay, so, right, at least that bit up there is safe. 
and it's marked for in the future or at least it's marked as a home in the future so like i said in between the first episode and this episode and where we are now we got some solar panels we got some batteries on the go here and we've got a little bit of um cooking area down here but all of our guys are pretty badly hurt but i managed to regain it um so what do we want next we really need these batteries going at least jackson's back up and he can finish that this remo is going to be so cranky oh no what mad animal uh, it's just a squirrel best way to do is to just tell him, tell him to hunt it mm. yeah it should be fine Great shot. Shot the dog. Oh, and as I said, shot the dog, my dog starts growling. Great. What's the matter? She's all curled up right up to the end of the sofa. Remo, get out there and haul that squirrel. Uh, right, so like I said in the first episode, what we want to do this one is we want to finish off our research, our stone cutting research, uh, which should happen this episode. Uh, and then we remo, make yourself useful, and finish building that. Uh, we're going to build up batteries. Uh, we are going to haul all of this stuff here there we are and there's a battery going hauling that stuff out looking good looking smart come on looking smart it's all tidy right oh stop it what are you walking over there for come build this um that's the battery all right uh the next thing i want to do while we're sorting out the um what's it called the stone cutting situation is i want to get some housing built Yeah, and I'm going to do that. I'm going to build the three rooms up along here. Dick, 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 dick. Oh, God, all these guys are doing sleep. i tell you what. We'll assign all of this. We can just... So in here, guys, you can, um, you can set what you want them to be doing at specific times of the day. So working, joy, or sleeping, or just anything. Um, especially at the start of the game, I just put it all to anything seems pretty effective um, like you just saw there you can sometimes just have to kind of force them to do stuff um, you can have your normal bed back she was sleeping she's just like resting yeah resting and now sleeping <clears throat> i suppose it takes a while to get sleep okay for them to do anything with this meat in here as well we need to add bills for them to do uh, so butcher creature do forever and add meal simple meal uh, we'll just do until we have 15 15 uh, oh she is just numbing down our medicine I'm gonna need to sort that out how's our crops coming along oh almost halfway already good 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 alright uh, Structure, and we'll just do this word one, two, three, four, and across, 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 that, and up, 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 and there we go. Remo, he is a ninja when it comes to mining. 
not a ninja when it comes to just building stuff. Ooh, ooh, Wanderer joins. Seth, nice to meet you, Seth. What are you good at? Well, you're passionate about constructing, so you're definitely gonna be a number one builder, and you can be the number one crafter as well. Ooh, not bad at shooting. You're gonna be a fighter as well. But you're naked, and that ain't helping nobody. But that's something we can sort out later. For now, Seth, you I'm gonna say your work. Work, 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 work. Come on. See I did promise in the first episode that I was gonna limit my singing. Oh well. Right, okay, so you're gonna be number one constructor. Uh so are you Let's set them all to it. And uh, no, we don't really want these on repair. So the reason why I don't want them on repair is because for repairing, um, you there's a there's a chance. So based on this skill, there's a chance of how well they're going to do it actually build or uh, successfully repair something. Um, so yeah, so if they're not very um, if they're not very skilled, um, it can just be a nightmare, and you're just wasting loads of components and all these expensive materials and just trying to get your turret back up or your battery going again or something like that. Um, so we want someone who's got a higher level of um, a higher level of construction to um, to repair all our stuff. This is coming together and we can start moving our beds in. Put them in there. Put them in there. And then we'll build another one. Brilliant, stone cutting is done. Okay, the next thing we want is... Let's just pause it for a second. What do we want next? Mm. Huh. Do we want to rush machining? Get weapons? Microelectronics? Um... Let's do that. Let's get our machining going. And I want to cancel that. Uh, so machining is going to allow us to build, um, to get some weapons, basically. We're going to be able to get some weapons on the go. Um, and that way we'll be able to defend ourselves a lot better. But more importantly, we managed to get. Um, I might need to. I'm gonna move this stockpile. Stockpile. And go there. And. Like this one, we don't want that. We don't want any of that. And we don't want any corpses. And then this one, we will delete. Go! And then production, stone cutting table, and I'm going to want that. Put up against the stone about Summer has arrived. Right, so we need to consider things like it's going to get hot, it's going to get stuffy. Uh, technically, everyone's sleeping outside at the moment, which isn't great. So we put some doors on this. And that should be alright. Uh, right. So, just dead. What? When did she die? Oh, God, not this again. Good job, Remo. Keep that ancient danger out. Well, we swapped. Someone who was pretty awesome for someone who is less awesome. So, oh, can't believe Graham died. Sad. 
Oh well, one down. This is not turning out to be the let's play I wanted it to be. I suppose it never does, does it? But um, we'll get them going. Oh, Seth, stop chilling. Get over there. We need somewhere to put Graham. The female Graham. Um, because she's a female. I'm sure it was female. Can't even say now. It just says it's a fresh port. Right. Um, God. This has really kind of messed everything up. No. We don't have enough wood. Oh, goody. Right, you can at least plant cut. So we need some wood. So we are gonna chop, choppy chop, choppy chop chop. Oh, there's a lot of wood here as well. There's choppy chop chop all over. So disappointed Graham's dead. More fire. Oh god. It's just such a long way to run every time. He can deal with that. Just focus on plant cutting. Yeah, why not run like the longest way around ever? Right. So we're kind of back on track. It's very loosely saying kind of. Uh, strip. At least you can wear our clothes. And that way... Oh, and here comes a raid. What joy. Forceware. And prioritize. So, are they going to come straight at us? Prepare defenses. So, it's just one guy with a steel shiv from the top right hand corner. So actually, that works pretty much in our favor. And I don't, did you like have trousers before? You do. So that's good. Right. And this attack should be coming. So, uh, one thing that's uh, that's cool to know about this game, guys, is that you can play with uh, something called permadeath, which I'm technically playing on with, for this let's play, but not so much because the permadeath setting is on, because uh, as you saw, it just auto saved. Okay, so here comes the attack. Uh, but like I, s I was saying, um, oh god, where has where's Graham's pistol gone? This is not working out in my favor. We are one weapon down. All right, so. I don't know where. Oh, the assault rifle would be up here, but has it burnt? It's probably burnt away by now, isn't it? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Right, so we definitely need to get machining going. Down. Pew. Oh, good shot. Nice. Not good. You attack. The only thing I don't like is that I can't for some reason run. Yeah. Get him. Nice. Oh, I was hoping I could capture. Them. Okay, so sometimes when you um, when you shoot at people or attack them, uh, they don't necessarily die straight away, and you can take their clothes, which is a very nice thing to be able to do. So we're going to set that as a medical bed because we're now down to three people. Um, 
Uh, but yeah, you can capture them, put them in prison, uh, you can build a little prison place, uh, and you can convert them to be your homies, your eternal bro. Um, but not this time. So, this has been a very, very chaotic, very intense start to, uh, to this game. So, uh, let's have a look at who is going to be you doing too social Seth you better be social oh six social not great not bad okay so well, let's do a little bit of trading here Come on. whoa there's quite a lot of stuff here um, so we are not bad on food oh there's not that much we can trade actually they have some herbal medicine exceedingly expensive um, that'll do for now. That's all we need. Uh, Seth, where did they? There it is. Prioritize all enough. There we go. All right, let's have a look. It's all looking very good. Okay, so. Um, what have we got? What have we got? What have we got? Let's let let's start off by making some kind of real base for ourselves here. Um, before we do that, we need to set Bill to do forever. Everything is going to take such a long time simply because I only have three guys to do it. So, I hope you are going to enjoy this Let's Play because it's going to be a relaxing one. It's going to be a little bit slow to start off with here. Um, but hopefully it will all work out pretty well in the end. We'll put both of them to do that. Remo is working like a horse right now. There we Jackson seems you just woke up by yourself. Oh, straight into a mental daze. Whoa. This really is rough. All right, guys, I'm going to leave it there for this time. And um, next episode, we are actually going to do something with the stone cutting that we researched. Um, I wish we could do something up there. Eventually, I think we'll need to put some like fire protect protection up there because that is going to be an absolute nuisance if it keeps on doing that. Um, yeah, so we're gonna get uh, we're gonna build ourselves a base. Uh, we're gonna look at doing potentially a killing room uh, if we can get that up and running at the same time, uh, and that way we've got some defensive going, uh, some defenses going, and uh, we'll get um, we'll get a little. Yeah, I think I think I think the the base building. I think coming up to here and across here and a killing room somewhere. I don't know what's gonna be most effective. Killing room probably here, in this area, just because it's quite central and that way we can get everyone to walk down that way. I think if we do it here, anything that spawns up here is going to be in a bit of trouble, unless unless we make the entrance of it. That's, that's something we'll, we'll look at next time, okay guys. Um, as always, uh, this is my, well not as always, but this is my second YouTube video. Um, so if you guys liked it, please hit the like button, please hit the subscribe button. Um, if you want to see some more, uh, some more let's plays, I've got some more games coming up as well. Um, so yeah, guys, please visit the channel, have a look around. You might find something you like, maybe find something you hate, you never know, but hopefully that won't happen. Um, but yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.